there with David and Jerry Zucker and Jim Abrahams, the creators of Airplane, one of the funniest movies of all time. I guess it was voted the 10th funniest uh, movie of all time. Uh, not not right us. Yeah. Not <laughs> right. We're trying to get to five. We're trying to get to five. Yeah. I'm always curious when we talk to people, when you guys think of San Francisco and the San Francisco Bay Area, what do you think of, and uh, or perhaps what's what's funny about it to you? I heard like one of you guys is a Republican and one is a Democrat. We're never really political at all in our work. I mean, we would make occasionally a political joke, but we never. I mean, and, and and interestingly, we when we started, it's not really interesting, but when we started, um, we at at the University of Wisconsin, it was. Uh, right after the bombing of the Army Math Research Center, it was 1970, and and uh, and it was, it, and we were criticized for not being political, uh, uh, by by some, you know, the press and stuff there, the local, the you know, and, and because uh, we weren't like the committee, which actually originated here, I think, and they were very, it was all about politics and everything, and we were just really uh, divorced from politics. It just, yeah, just wanted to be silly. And it seemed like Nixon was just too easy. Right. Yeah. Doing a Nixon joke. Yeah, right? doing a yeah. Nixon joke. It's everybody to do that. But I think we did media jokes, which really had replaced politics by that time, in our mind. But every morning when we got together to start writing airplanes, we would discuss... Are there any lines <coughs> that you get uh, uh, tired of hearing quoted coffee, back to you? Uh, uh, is there the line water maybe the one that's most water. often yeah. quoted back to you? or? Do people come up to you and start just talking lines from the movie, or uh, not really? Yeah, they do, and we love it. Right. Yeah, <laughs> love it. it never get gets tired. annoying. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Unless they get physically abusive, but no. <laughs> no, I don't think anybody who does that kind of stuff for a, a profession ever gets tired of hearing. You know, I'll be in public and and my kids or someone will say, "Oh, there's a celebrity. Can I? Is it okay if I go say hi?" Absolutely, go say hi and say I love your work, and they can't get enough of it.